choose an external and allows us to update the handle with the URI, uh, with the new URI, okay? So we require owner. And this is one that I wanted to chat with you about uh, because usually we tend up to use modifiers on uh, Solidity. Um, so we would have only owner modifier and that only owner would um, make its own magics and uh, revert if uh, we are not the owner of the transaction, of, of the, the handle, uh, the one that is sending the transaction. So in this case, it's not a good idea because uh, it would require us to translate handles into IDs in every function even if they had already been translated or converted in the only owner modifier. So that's why I didn't use modifier here. I created a, an internal function called require owner, which returns the ID uh, if everything is okay. So if in, in here, we have required owner and it uh, returns the token ID and changes uh, converts from token id to, to from handle to token id and checks if the token id uh the owner of the token id is different than the message sender and uh reverts in that case okay so it just returns the token id to for every for the outside and so we can continue using that token ID without requiring us to make an extra conversion, which is not a very um, complex uh, operation. But if we can save gas, why won't we, right? So, yeah, this is the... Um, the require owner and then we are set 